Convicted double murderer Wade Wilson has been sentenced to death for the 2019 murders of Christine Melton and Diane Ruiz in Cape Coral. The sentencing came after this morning's Spencer hearing, a recess, and an additional delay from a sprinkler system issue. The Spencer hearing allowed both sides of the trial to appeal directly to the judge and for the judge to evaluate specific evidence related to Wilson's criminal history and his character. Wilson's defense attorney also attempted to prove that Wilson had a brain injury and a last-ditch effort to save his life. Wilson appeared in court today in an orange jail jumpsuit after the judge denied his defense's request to put him in street clothes. After the sentencing, during a news conference, we got the chance to hear from the families of Melton and Ruiz. Wade supporters have not been quiet, but we all know that the loudest ones are always the dumb ones. Let, let you know that this is not the end. The end is when the Q's takes his last breath, and I will be there at the execution. And that's a promise. Wilson, who you see here, will be back in court on September 16th for his other pending charges, specifically related to trying to escape from jail. The goal is to get those cases resolved as soon as possible and off to death row.